Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. On today's episode, we're going to be going over uh, mounting stands. I've had a couple of viewers uh, send in some uh, questions asking about what type of stands they use. So uh, I thought I'd do a quick video here and just kind of go over and show you the stands and uh, kind of show you how they work and, you know, kind of tell you why I like them. Um, I got these from McKenzie Taxidermy Supply and uh, they work really well. Um, they've got a, it's kind of a system here. I've got the, the, the floor stand. And then I've also got the uh, wall mount stands back here. And what I like about these stands is, is you can, the heads on them are interchangeable. So just for an example, I'll show you how quick and easy it is to uh, install a form here. Um, I've got a white tail form. And Mackenzie, if you, if you buy uh, forms from them, they have these hangers that they supply with a lot of their forms. And these stands, the heads on them are made, they're slotted, they're made to lock in to these uh, Form. So what you do, you would install this hanger on the back of this form right here. And then once you do that, once you get it screwed in, it's got a slot here. This little slot on the mounting stand will actually slide right on. Like so. That holds, that holds your uh, form. And then all you got to do is get you a drill and a couple of drywall screws. And there's holes in the back of this plate right here. You just take your drill, I usually put one diagonal across from each other, and that'll, that'll hold it in there, it's locked into place. And uh, these, they've got, they've got double locks on them here for your tilt. I know a lot of stands, some of the older ones, like the old ones I used to use, they were, they were bad about it. You could, they would have one knob on them, you'd be mounting it constantly, it'd just be falling down. But with these double locking knobs, I mean, you can put anything from bear to, to elk. I've done elk on them. Uh, white-tailed deer definitely ain't gonna, ain't gonna affect how, you know, the, how they sit up here. They've also, you can, uh, not only can you go up and down that way, you can, you can spin, it, spin it around. You've got T-handles to be able to turn it. And then down here on the pole mount, you got another T-handle, you can adjust the height of it. Um, but one good thing I like about this stand is, you can take it and uh, loosen up your T-handle here, and say, just for example, say we're working on this deer, and uh, we get it mounted up, and usually what I'll do after I get them mounted up, after the second day work, and I get the eyes and everything where I want them, get all the skin laid in there like it needs to be, you can loosen this handle up, come here, and you can slide this whole bracket off of this stand and then all you got to do is you see the wall mount stand here it's just screwed into the wall it's got a t-handle also you just loosen it up you can pull your pull your bracket out slide it over here in your, in your floor mount stand and then you can take the one that's got your deer mounted to it your form here slide it in there lock it in and uh you can still, once you get it in there and you got your, say your deer here is mounted, you can uh, you can come back and you know, you can tweak on the hide, you can rotate it around. It won't tilt up and down, but it will spin, you know, uh, left to right. Um, but I just thought I'd do this video just so y'all can kind of see what I'm doing. Uh, I'll add in some clips here of the base part of this stand and maybe some close-ups of this wall mount so you can get an idea of kind of what they look like. Uh, uh, if you haven't hit that subscribe button, hit that subscribe button and uh, give these videos a like. It helps out my channel. And uh, as always, thanks for watching and God bless.